What's up everybody, this is Brian Pfeiffer, MarketingMeatHead.com, and today I'm going to tell you about how I got the opportunity to get a $150,000 EIDL loan, and it just happened today. Alright, hot off the press here guys, I just got an email, uh, create your SBA economic injury disaster loan a porthole, so uh, the... <laughs> Come on, don't bullshit me. Funny, I did a video on this yesterday, and I got this email uh, late in the middle of the night last night, so I'm sure... Some of you are probably waking up to this email, and uh, that brings you over to a portal, okay, and uh, you log in, and it's pretty simple. This is going to be your actual loan for uh, after you got the grant. I got a $4,000 grant, and then after you uh, log in, I think I had the wrong password in here, so let's see if that works, and uh, yeah, so I'm in here, okay, so... This is your um, loan amount confirmed. Okay, you can actually change this. So you can adjust the loan how you want it. And then here's your interest rate. Here's your, gonna be your monthly payment. That looks like the, uh, the repayment starts 12 months after closing. Uh, there's a $100 filing fee and then your payment's gonna be 731. And that's a 3.75% loan over 30 years. So pretty good. Uh, obviously, I'm gonna go for the, uh, the max here because I can always, uh, if I, just in case I you know don't need it, I can always pay it back earlier. So I'll go ahead and accept that. And then here's, here's where things get a little janky. Uh, I'm going to probably go ahead and have to blur a little of this out, but uh, this is where you put in your bank account information, and this is where you would do the signing of the closing documents. Uh, however, this website is not working properly, okay? So it's a little frustrating. Uh, I did submit a request, and because it asked me some questions here, and so I go in and I do the questions, and uh, it just keeps going in the, into the loop here. Uh, one of the questions is your birthday. I'm going to blur this out, but... Uh, then the next one is, uh, you know, what city uh, was your county was your Chicago address in? And then it asked me what my uh, house is, whether it's a single family or apartment or townhome. And then uh, asked me what uh, county have I lived. So I answer all the questions correctly. I submit the answers. And then it just puts me into a loop of, more, of the same questions over and over again. So it, it's just not working, unfortunately. Uh, you know, it is what it is. It is what it is. It is what it is. But I'm like that close to getting that $150,000 loan right now, which will like pretty much save the day. Uh, I have no idea when the nightclubs in Las Vegas is going to reopen. Uh, this money I can put in the bank and I can use it to keep my, my team going. We're rebuilding websites right now. We're still in business. I'm still getting quotes and a couple just came in a few minutes ago. So people are anticipating us to come back at some point and I got to keep, you know, people on staff to, uh, you know, help with the business. I mean, that's part of the deal. Uh, I didn't, you know, choose to like go out of business. That was like by choice of the government. So the government is now helping us back. And that's kind of the way it's supposed to work. We pay taxes and then eventually, you know, if you need help, they're going to help you out. And it looks like they're going to help us out here. So this is good news. I didn't want to make this video too long. Uh, unfortunately, I, I haven't really got confirmation that I'm going to get this money. I haven't got the actual money in my account, but it looks like I have the opportunity to get this money. It's just there's a problem with the website right now. No! Uh, let me know in the comments if you guys are having a, a same problem that I am, because I'm curious to see if it's just me or it's actually uh, an issue with the porthole, which I'm guessing it is because this is probably just tossed up tonight and they probably are having some kind of technical difficulties. Uh, you know, the coding or something's a little bit off, but uh, that's kind of the way things work. But uh, leave me a comment below. Let me know if you got the same thing, if you have an opportunity to get this $150,000 loan, if you're going to take it, and if you're having problems getting it through the porthole, I would love to know. I'm Brian Fife from The Marketing Meathead. Make sure you like this video, share it with your friends, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.